All right, what is going on everyone and welcome to our yearly Call of Duty Black Ops 3 game. My name is John and I'll be your host for this let's play walkthrough playthrough whatever you guys want to call it of this game. So as you guys may imagine Call of Duty is multiplayer. Most people are going to be playing at 40 multiplayer and so am I but we're going to be doing the campaign first. I don't assume this game is going to be that long usually Call of Duty games are quite short. But if you have been following my channel for a really long time now, you would know that my channel, my first few videos were Call of Duty. I even still have them on my channel to this day. And that was before I started doing Let's Plays. So Call of Duty will always have a place on my channel. And I hope you guys are going to enjoy this series as much as I do. Um, now, I will be doing some multiplayer as well. But we're going to be doing the campaign first. So with that said... If you guys are going to enjoy the series, drop a like on the video. L let's get this off to a good start with a like. And yeah, so I will be giving away two copies of this game, any platform of your choice. All you have to do is let me know which one. You don't have to like the video. You don't have to subscribe, even though both of those would be very appreciated. None of them are required. And I'll be picking a few or two people throughout the next week. So that gives everyone a chance to at least watch the video. So with that said, uh, we're going to start up the campaign on oh, Customize Your Operative. Oh, okay. So we could be Default Soldier or a badass lady with that looks cooler. I don't care. You can actually, whoa, customize the face. Wait, let me... Wait, can you go back? Uh, which one looks cool? They all kind of look the same. We'll just choose that one. Um, now, they actually did add a new difficulty. And this is the realistic mode. Um, That's probably not going to be happening on recording. Just because I'll probably get wrecked a lot. So we're going to play on just uh, the regular difficulty and I'll probably be streaming the hard, harder difficulties so you guys can watch me play that as well but with that said let's start it up oh you can actually just change everything whenever you want but that's cool let's get started oh wait you can play the campaign with other people that, alrighty well let's start up the game we'll play solo Bioaugmentation has become commonplace throughout the developed world. The sheer scale of this disaster has overwhelmed the authorities. Superstorms continue to hammer the region, hampering relief efforts. These are uncertain times. Our future depends upon the choices we make. As populations continue to expand, megacities emerge worldwide. The extreme conditions have led to a vast exodus of displaced residents. WA bases were on high alert this morning. Direct energy air defenses neutralized the attack almost immediately. Protesters and local forces clashed again today, resulting in yet more bloodshed. Make no mistake, this is a new Cold War. We may not always see our enemies, but they are out there. My name is Jacob Hendricks. I'm your new CO. This is Egyptian Minister Saeed, taken hostage by NRC forces two days ago. After the uprisings in Cairo, they may want to make an example of him. Punish him. We're not going to let that happen. Just so we're clear, if this goes wrong, you never existed. The NRC are going to be here soon. We got about one minute to create the mother of all distractions. Tower, I need all traffic diverted from runway one nine. Copy that. Diverting traffic to runway one one. 
Cargo 4019er, we have a fuel fire on runway 19. Divert course for landing to runway 11. Please confirm. Hey, why is it so long? All right, you're up. Okay. Hacking module in place. Recalibrating dead system targeting. We got company. Dead, manual override. Please select target. In Hold on. Before we do that, I think the audio is too low. So we will be... That's good. Confirmed. Targeting parameters accepted. Now, you're showing us as target locked. This is an NRC friendly coming in. All is good down here. Possible malfunction at your end? Fire now! Firing! Dead system engaging target. Firing. Open the door! Shit! Get out! Let's get this done! Oh, I didn't know those were enemies. Taylor, the version is in play. Bird is down. Confirmed. Sentries are leaving their post to respond to the crash. Proceed to the package. Make the grab before it breaks. It's broken. We're on it. See you at the RP. Roger that. Okay, so it's gonna take me a little bit to get used to the controls again. It's been well, a while since I played a Call of Duty game. These uniforms should allow us to slip by unnoticed. As long as we don't have to talk to anyone. So keep your mouth shut. Security stations across the way in the tunnels. Once there, we'll be able to pinpoint the minister's exact location. Heads and weapons down. Keep it cool until we make the grab. I'll follow your lead. Just keep your head down. Bro, no way. By the way, let me know how the audio is so I can always adjust it. My voice, is it too loud? Is the game too loud? I can always adjust it. I can't do anything. All I can do is switch weapons, but I can't even shoot it. I can't knife. Go. Can't run. Taylor, we're at the security station. Moving to secure. I hear you, Hendrix. Let's do this. Ready when you are. What are we doing? I'll kill the alarms on this floor. Get plugged in and locate the minister. Taylor, scanning for package. Waiting for hit on facial recognition. Other hostages? I thought it was only the minister. Yeah, so did I. Poor sons of bitches. The NRC are known for their brutality. Taylor, did you know there were other prisoners? The minister is the only priority. Understood. Check the next feed. Are we just gonna leave them to be tortured? We have our orders. No match. That's him, the minister. He's being moved. We have to find out where they're taking him. 
That's brutal. You're just, like, forced to watch torture scenes. Only in a Call of Duty game. Bingo. Match confirmed. Moving to secure. ETA? Two minutes. Two minutes. I'll be timing you. Son of a bitch was never funny. You sound like the voice of experience. Trust me. I am. Alright, so it's dark as fuck out there. You know, I would have thought the AI have some sort of accuracy. Oh, you're not dead? Or is there two of them? I feel like there's no auto or auto aim on the campaign. Eat this. Got our first trophy, boys. Okay, maybe there is auto aim. I just can't feel it. The guns actually sound pretty good, Cell like, ahead. realistically. On me. Placed. Alright. Let's go! I'll take point. You've reached observation. So far, the campaign feels, like, not generic. You invaded our home. We only did what we have to do. Cannot. Interrogator has us back to the door. Two sentries inside. Okay. Their guards my down. People, you are coward. On my mark. Three, two, one. Go! We're, going to... We're here to extract you. Do as I say, and you'll make it through this. What about Lieutenant Khalil and the others? Sorry, no time. Khalil was a hero of the Cairo uprising. You know that makes him a valuable asset for their propaganda. They will make an example of him. Fuck! All right, let's go! Here, this one. Get the door, I'll cover. All right. All right. We're going in, boys. Let's go. Three, two, one. I'll cut the poor bastard down. Maybe you should watch the door just in case. Minister. Khalil. Hendrix, can you fight Khalil? Always. We'll grab a weapon from the locker room up ahead and reprogram it to match your biometrics. I like how they lock my Sounds gun. Sounds like they're finally on to it. Let's move. Taylor, package plus one, secure and inbound. Plus one. Your orders were to extract the minister. His name is Lieutenant Khalil. Sound familiar? Get moving. We'll see you topside. Depot ahead will be heavily guarded. Get ready to go loud. All right, I got the guys on the top. I just want to say this is my first Call of Duty I've ever played on a PS4. Everything has been on Xbox. Not that it really matters. So, getting used to it might take a little bit longer than usual. That's our exit. Cargo elevator up ahead. Alright, hold on. Position is secure. 
Grenades are everywhere. Sensitivity feels wonky. I wish they had only like one different one instead of vertical and horizontal. Get in the elevator. It'll take us up to the hangar. Clear out the NRC so we can get topside. Diversity. Oh, I couldn't hit them for some reason. It just feels wonky. Drop your weapon. Lower them now. We're dead if we do. Trust me. We're dead if we don't. Drop them. Move forward. Late. Your imaginary watch is fast. Nice to see you, Jacob. You too, John. You look look different. You still seeing Rachel? Now is probably not the time to be asking that. That's a pity. Mm -hmm. yeah. New blood? Gonna take care of them as good as you did me? That's not funny, man. We still set on our Xville? Charges are set. All right, good to go. Xville in 10. Diaz, you're on babysitting duty. Let's roll. Stay close. Ooh, I want camo. Good. I was in the mood for a fight. Moving to the next hangar. Go, 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 go. On my position, let's take the high road. Ah, the, I thought that was like something else. I didn't think that was an exploding barrel. Usually the red, not yellow. Nice work. Looking at Keep that up. You may live through this. Oh no, AI move. Yeah. Are they still on the catwalk? Here we go. Go, go, go. Get to Axville. I got these guys. Go! Weapons are no good against that APC. Uh. We gotta bring down that VTOL. Aim for the missile. APC is down. Diaz, I'm in position. Copy that. I can't see them. They kind of blend in. Not even the camo, it's just dark. So this gun feels like you have to burst it a little bit more. Just because um, the accuracy of these the recoil is pretty bad. Wait, can we just spam nades? Oh, there's not unlimited resupply. They learned after Modern Warfare 2.
Try and keep up, all right? That technical's mine. Give me some cover fire. Get to the bridge. I'll keep them busy. Reddy's got you from here. Next fill is across the bridge up ahead. They'll still be right on our ass. We've set charges all across the base to cover our exfil. We detonate as soon as we're across the bridge. All right. No one follows us. How many are there? Now we got a fight. Those AFBs are blocking our route to Exville. All right, so we, is there like a weak spot to that, or am I just not seeing it? Reinforcements coming over the bridge. What's the plan? Ah, fuck it. Plan B. Blow the bridge. We're moving to secondary expo. Blow the bridge. All righty. Primary expo is compromised. Moving on to secondary. Copy that. Rendezvous at Hotel Tango. We'll use the APCs. Roger that. Accessing building's electrical systems. Heads up, we have multiple hostiles inside the comms room. A building? Killing lights! What? You expect us to fight in the dark? Something like that. Sending tactical feet to your HUD. Ooh. Remember. They ain't got the night vision. Take it slow. Pick them off. I wonder if in realistic, they would actually have night vision. Use your advantage. Run in and knife them? Alrighty. I was gonna do that until I saw the grenade indicator. That's actually pretty cool. Now what? Beetle's got us pinned down. Easy, hold your fire. He's mine. Ah! Taylor, oh. Alpha Two team is rejoined for Xville. Comes easy hey, now, never. doesn't it, Taylor? Extract is the satellite tower. Commandeer vehicle and get you to extraction. Wait, do we actually get ex Oh, we do get experience from playing the campaign. You didn't answer me, John. Take it to Nice. Keep up. Secondary routes just ahead. Ain't too many. So it pays off to not actually suck at this game. Alrighty. That's a good start. If I you guys to hear push. that? You hearing things already? That itchy finger of yours is infecting your ears. Hey, fuck you. Shut up. I hear it too. Listen. Holy shit. Contact! Contact! Oh shit, I didn't I'll know we were playing Metal Gear Solid again. A shitload of them. We need that door open now. Give us some cover fire. Get inside. Go, go, go. Get to the extract. We'll deal with the robot. Oh my god, we're running right now. Oh, oh. Taylor, we're in the clear. We can take it from here. Those other hostages we saw, you can get them out. Not a mission priority. It may not be a mission priority, but there's still people, damn it. Or have you changed so much that you've forgotten what that feels like? All right, change of plan. 
Hendrix, your team will escort the minister to the extract. We'll go back and get the hostages. More robots. Yeah, don't worry about them. We're built to handle them. Go on, get out of here. Go! Do I get to drive a tank? Yo, let me shoot. Yo, I got, I got the this. wheel. Get on the turret. <gasps> Yes. Yo, it's on. Get ready. We got a shitload of grunts moving on our position. Free XP, boys. Let's go. Keep fire on that VTOL. We gotta take a detour. Hang on. I got it. Don't worry about me. This actually looks pretty realistic. I like it. Inbound, VTOL! Redirect fire! Fuck! Damn piece of shit stalled out! Hang on! Hendrix? Start the damn thing! What the hell do you think I'm doing? Come on! Start, you fucker! Hold them back! This piece of shit ain't dying on us yet! Free X, free spray down! I feel like some people are actually gonna prestige just from killing all of these. Let me see. Nope. Not as much. Seconds. I'm sending drop coordinates your way. Hendrix, additional primary secure. Get that minister out of here. Moving to secondary it's rendezvous like with plus four. That packages. mission in battlefield, Copy like the second one. You drive and crash into like the water or something. Battlefield three, I believe. Yeah. Exfil pod first pass en route. Hang tight down there. Pod detached. Exfil airspace non viable. Drone will sweep around for second pass. Oh, run! Minister, oh God. Are you right? oh Can you move? Oh, my God. I'm Ooh. fine. I'm fine. Please just get me out of here. We gotta move! Let's get out of here! Now! I can't get in. Hold them back! Position. Drone concentrating fire on multiple targets. Let's wrap this up, boys. Keep them back. We're almost out of here. Minister almost secure. Keep those NRC bastards busy. Woo. Drone is in Go. position, ready for pickup. Secure. Get your ass over here now. Get your ass over here now. Move. Window is closing. Airspace is compromised. No, no, no! Fuck! Get to the APC! Get out of there! Taylor, my team's still at Xville! More NRC grunts moving in! Inbound, two minutes. Hang tight, you're not dying today. So we're going to be augmented for the rest of the game. Where 
am I? It's okay. Calm down. Just relax. You're gonna be fine. You're smart enough. Achieved our objectives. A man's always gonna be better than machine. Unfortunately, you sustained life-threatening injuries. You're stable, but you got a long way to go. Who are you? It's me, Taylor. I think it's time you woke up, don't you? Zurich. Yeah. Hey. Uh. Still with us? Welcome back. Taylor? Yeah. Do you know what's happening to you? Am I dreaming? Well, let's say you are. Why not just go with it, right? After all, you can always wake up. December 12th, 2054, 7.30 a.m. We're on board a private commuter train headed to the Zurich headquarters of the Coalescence Corporation. Our uh, cargo, prototype for the Winslow Accord Neural Network Initiative. At its core, specialized AI software that's capable of rewriting itself in order to interface with any other system in the world. State-of-the-art stuff back in the day. It'd go on to revolutionize a broad range of military and civilian applications. At least, it would have if the train had reached its destination. At 7.31 a.m., a terrorist group detonated an explosive device on board this train. The incident sent back our robotics program several years. You're here to stop it. This isn't real. It can't be. What's happening to me? Right now? Right now, you're in a medically induced coma being prepped for surgery. You've got a new bit of hardware inside your head. It's called a direct neural interface, or DNI. I've got one, too. That's how I'm able to communicate with you. Your DNI is what connects your mind with your new body and the larger world around you. We're connected. All of this is a simulation inside our minds. And you got a long way to go. That's kind of creepy and kind of cool at the same time. trippy loading screen oh god hello oh is this berlin wall from black ops one whoa rpg 11 30 a.m december 11th 2054 zerk security forces receive an anonymous tip giving them the location of a hideout the terrorists are using unfortunately the zsf underestimated the firepower these assholes were packing they got caught with their pants down and they took it hard. Outcome? Train go boom. You remember Diaz? I think so. I'm gonna help get you up to speed on some of the cool new shit you can do. Communication. We all gotta be in sync. Yo, Taylor. You're a fucking dick. He didn't hear shit. If I wanna talk to you, the DNI transmits on a closed channel. I don't even have to think about it. But, uh, just so you know, if you ever think about calling Taylor a dick for real, he's gonna mess you up worse than those robots. All right, let's go see if you can do this without ending up with Swiss cheese like those poor bastards. Okay, Ooh. weapons hot. That's actually kind of cool. The way they do this is actually pretty unique. Oh, 
I like it. Treyarch has always been a good company, or right. the developers have always, they always made route. the Take good high, campaigns. Low, left, right. Different paths yield different advantages. <laughs> One burst doesn't kill him? Okay, you could just eat it. Your DNI can provide combat critical info to help you better read the battlefield. Switch it to tactical mode. How do I do that? Like opening your eyes for the first time, right? Oh. Dude, get out of the way, fuck. Enemies ahead. Grenade out. I don't know if it's on or off. Okay, that's off. All right. That's on. Use your enhanced mobility. It may take a little getting used to, but your confidence will soon grow. Try it for yourself. I got a hunter says you can do it. Yeah, I messed to up my first run, time press too. X. You'll get the hang of it. I oh, see. Attack mode will highlight inbound threats such as rockets and grenades. You see flashing red. Move. That's kind of cool. If I don't, I would think that's a little overpowered in multiplayer, but for the campaign, that's fine. That's really cool, though. Uh, that was kind of dumb. Almost died there. Hey, it's like World at War again. All the grenade spam. See the red and yellow markers? They represent kill zones. Not somewhere you want to be. Reinforcements at the truck. Bro, oh, that says he's armored. Luckily, my accuracy isn't completely garbage. Just a little bit, though. God, let's not do that. Attack mode info is synced across the team. One of us sees something, we all see it, even through cover. That's actually really cool. Check your ammo. Grab more if you need it. Keep moving up. Uh. It's a little delayed, but it's fine. Shoot me through the cracks, please don't shoot me.
DNI doesn't just help us communicate with each other. It allows us to interact with a variety of computer systems, including pretty much all the basic drone units. Now, bipeds, sophisticated ground units, those are a whole lot trickier. Those sons of bitches got a damn hive mind. You try to process and control all that, your brain is toast. But these? These fuckers are easy. Go ahead. Hack in. Go we'll see what's on the other side of this wall. Fits like a glove, right? Now somewhere through there is a generator. Take it out and that door should open. Whoa. I wish that thing wouldn't fly over my head. Like, that's actually kind of loud. Yo, you wanna see something cool? Shoot down those bats. Haha! <laughs> You're a maniac! Joking aside, remember your environment. It can help you move. But it can also help you kill. That would have been an instant death in realistic mode. Oh, now it started moving. I could have done that this whole time and just didn't say anything when I went through there. I'm afraid the EMP blast from the generator was fried your drum. Come on, let's go. It's fine. Grab fresh ammo whenever you see an ammo crate. Last thing you want is to be in a fight with no bullets. Hey, thanks for sharing that information right there. I appreciate it. Suppressors, second level. If you want to get creative, you can use remote hijack on those turrets. Target a turret. Come on. Nice going. Now turn it back on that tear them up. Use your environment. Shoot down those vats. What? Shoot what down? Might as well save my ammo while I'm in here, right? So like one clip and a half. Okay, that's down. Generally taking out the people is a lot easier. That got that one person. What you got? 
Got it. Nope. There you go, you're dead now. The faction's hideout is just ahead. Once inside, interface with the central console. Pull any data you can. Hey, it's okay. It's okay. Just take a second. Take a deep breath in and tell me what happened. Like I was back in Ethiopia. The grunts. I lived it all over again. What's happening to me? Shit. You know how your senses can trigger vivid memories? Make you think of sounds, sights, words from songs. Make you think of stuff you haven't thought of in years. The DNI can make that a lot more visceral. Little glitches on your optics, little whispers in your ear. This shit happens. The doctor can straighten it out. You just need to recalibrate your meds. Trust me, you're gonna be fine. What happens now? Oh, right now? You're gonna interface with that console. As soon as you plug in, you'll be able to extract and process the information in a heartbeat. Got it. They had a man on the inside at Coalescence. He would have been able to supply them with everything they needed to bypass the security on the train. The botched assault meant it took six hours for the ZSF to get that information. Outcome? Train go boom. Took you just six minutes. Yeah, it would have been five. If you hadn't freaked out when you saw those robots. So, what happens now? Now we go find the son of a bitch. Something he tells me he's like the main enemy of the game. He just seems like that kind of guy. Or the main antagonist. Yeah. Uh. High rise. Modern Warfare 2 maps all over again. Oh my god, the memory. Tipped off by his terrorist pals. The mole was ready for him. He had heavy duty combat grunts with him. Once again, the Zerk security force got their asses handed to him. Outcome train go boom. We lost him. He slipped away. You remember Specialist Sarah Hall? She's gonna walk you through the next part. Trust her, do exactly what she says. I trained her myself. She's an intelligence expert from back when that actually meant something. Before DNI, you had to read books. In the Academy, Taylor made me read a lot of them. Well, some knowledge is worth earning. Appreciating. And that takes time. Time is something we don't always have. Okay, New Blood. From this point on, the simulation deviates from actual events. Not that it's gonna feel any less real. Use your imagination. Sending his location to your HUD. Ooh. Come on now, pick up the trail. Ooh, that fires really, really quickly. I still have line of sight. Our boy's hacking the ZSF talons. What does that tell you? He's running scared. He's not sitting behind a computer. He could only be controlling them if he's got a DNI too. You're a smart one, New Blood. I'll give you that. You got potential. Son of a bitch is still moving. So, chase scene, essentially. Billboard to get over the maglev train. He's heading into old Zurich. Move. All right, activating a new cyber ability. System paralysis. Open fire. 
You're getting the hang of this, aren't you? Your cyber abilities don't come for free. They take a little time to recharge. Keep an eye on your HUD. Yeah, but you get a free EMP. Mirror's Edge? Why are all these buildings here? Take All right, got to keep up. Don't lose them now, newbie. Didn't work out so well, huh? I reckon our suspect has about 15 seconds left before he shakes hands with the Grim Reaper. You can't let that happen. Not before you get the information we need. I don't think he's in any condition to talk. He doesn't have to. He has a DNI. Buried beneath layers of security protocols, the subject's DNI records cam footage of the user's past experiences. In extreme circumstances, it is possible to extract that information by force. You'll be able to push deep into the subject's memories, their thoughts, even their subconscious. You could learn everything we need to know about the terrorist plans. I'm sensing a but coming up somewhere. You should know. Not only will this procedure be deeply traumatic for the subject, but the associated subconscious interference will leave him brain dead dead believe me this is a bad way to go he's a dead man anyway you said it yourself besides he's a fucking terrorist A few minutes ago, you knew nothing. What do you know now? I know where they are. They're using the old train tunnels to plan their attack. Hmm. But you just learned that your DNI took the ZSF weeks to uncover. What do you think I'm gonna say next? Outcome. Train go boom. It's good to know you can make tough decisions when you have to. I think it's time we moved on. That was a good mission. I liked it. That trippy loading screen. Whoa. You're taking heavy fire! That's a backup! The ZSF finally tracked down the terrorists to this location. For their sake, they really wish they hadn't. You're still here, huh? Pity. I bet Diaz has a hundred that you'd be dead by now. Funny man, Specialist Peter Moretti. He's gonna help you understand how much of a badass motherfucker you are now. But remember, we still don't have the last piece of the puzzle. How in the hell they got the explosives on board the train? So we're clear? When this is over, you owe me a hundred. Back to business. As you know, one of the perks of being Black Ops is having access to the latest in experimental weaponry. Firearms may be your go-to choice for a weapon in a fight. But with DNI, your mind truly is your greatest weapon. Let's do some damage. Woo! You got a new cyber ability to play with. Uh, immolation. Give it a spin on those enemies ahead. Is pretty solid. Not bad, new blood. Oh. 
pretty sure I just got a six piece right there. Just like your other core systems, you select your loadout. Use these systems to seize the tactical advantage, whatever the opposition. Okay, I've loaded a second cyber ability into your core. Fireflies, a swarm of incendiary nanobots. Let them loose and see what they can do. That honestly looks pretty dumb. I'm starting to like you. Okay, I didn't really like that ability. It just seems so plain. a long time for them. Do they even die from that? Or is that just like a stun? Why do robots get affected by that? I don't understand. Switching to your EV helps whenever you're blind, whether in the dark or in smoke. How about that? Now you never have to worry about what's lurking in the darkness. This is not over! I wish it didn't keep scanning like that. It's kind of annoying. But I guess game balance, I guess. Get some cover! We'll make a soldier out of you yet. God, my aim is getting there. I feel like I actually understand this game now. It's only been an hour. Oh, hello. I keep forgetting this is an LMG. Cybernetics not available. How did that one slip past? You sneaky. Got him. Are we level? Oh god, I. Oh, I thought I died. <laughs> we fell. Oh no, collectibles in Taking this game Taking the mechanic bay again. below. Looks like they got into the water treatment plant through here. On me. Keep your fucking head down. You may be a badass, but you're 
you're not immortal. Bullet to the head, I'll still get you a date with your maker. Can you not walk in front of my... Oh my god. This goes on. I'm Hound's on the work floor. I feel like I'm playing Deus Ex or something where I, I'm in like a straight augmented. Save your super for uh, the robots for that. Good hunting. Interface with that door for me. What is this place? This. This is where it all went down. The computer over there should give us some insight into how they got the explosives on board. Go interface. It's the robots. They hacked the security robots. They brought the explosives on board. I see. You want to hear something ironic? The reality was the terrorist attacks actually accelerated the development of the Winslow Accord Neural Network Initiative. If it wasn't for the fear of attacks like this one, we probably wouldn't even have the Cyber Soldier program. Hang in there. 725. Got about five minutes. You've been here before, New Blood. Let's see if you can change history. 